and welcome to this chapter of Somerville High School Basketball. I'm Jim Muncy, about to introduce Bob Kaluti. Before I do, let me tell you, Somerville High School will be playing Cambridge Ridge and Latin, the Falcons. But first, I want to bring on Bob Kaluti in just a second to tell you a real story, what happened to him today. It's not a joke. It's not a skit. This is real stuff. You can't make this up. What you're about to see is not fictional. It actually happened, and the participant is not an actor. Bob, come on, Bob. I can't stand it. Thank you, Jim. Let them have it. I was involved in something today that's beyond irony. Yep. All right, check this out. I skipped my college class today, which I recommend you do not do, so I can go try out a new hockey stick that I put together myself last night. A new wow. hockey stick at stick practice gym. All right, everything's fine. I could have chose three rinks, Arlington, Wuben, Peabody. Arlington, I couldn't go to Wuben, nobody answered, so I went to Peabody. Good choice. 40 minutes all the way up to Peabody, Jim, to play stick practice to try out my new stick. Everything's going fine, I scored a goal, I like my new stick, we're skating, we're having a good time. About an hour later, there was action in front of my crease. Next thing I know, some guy's stick hits me right above the left eye. Ah, oh, stop it. I had to go to the hospital. I got six stitches above this right eye. And what happened when you got to the hospital, Bob? <laughs> this this a, is the kicker. That's a funny, that's a funny story, Jim. <laughs> when I, got, I drove 40 minutes from Peabody to the Allenton, rest, the Allenton Hotel, not restaurant, hotel. Hotel? Hospital. I mean, all right. <laughs> so, I'm, I, I got six stitches in my left eye, Jim. I'm losing it. I'm uh, hallucinating. Anyway, I get to the hospital. I got blood all over my shirt, blood all over my face. I got a, a piece of gauze holding up to my eye. And this is mere hours ago? Yes, mere hours ago. I walk up to the reception area, I take the gauze off my eye, and I stand there. You know what she says? What'd she say, Bob? After a five second pause, this lady says, Can I help you with something? <laughs> <laughs> What'd you say? I said, yeah, I'm looking for the produce section. What do you mean, can you help me with something? Of course you can. I got, I got an abrasion above my left eye. <laughs> and the ironic part to all of this for fans at home is for the first time in the five years that Jim and Bob have been doing this Somerville High School basketball coverage on Channel 15, the educational channel, the first time we really didn't know how to open the show today. We didn't have a video. We didn't have a skit, a no. funny dance, a song and dance, a all poem. All week. All we've been racking our brains what to do. Bob comes home with the story. We say, tell it on the air. Maybe he'll get some get well fan mail. The 26 Bowdoin Street, B-O-W-D-O-I-N, in Arlington, 02174. Well, I'm sorry to hear that, Bob, but I am glad you're here, because if you weren't here and I was alone, it wouldn't be Jim and Bob and there'd be no opening. That's right, Jim. She said, can I help you with something? Yeah, that, that's, that's, and she gets paid for that. Yeah. She gets paid for that. And you and, you and I are poor. We're poor. Right. We're, We're poor. poor. Basketball game tonight, Bob. Cambridge Ridge and Latin, the Falcons, to take on the Summerville High School Highlanders. Uh, Summerville High School is 6-8 six and eight overall, 6-6 six and six in the league, and the Cambridge record, 8-5 and five in the league, 9-5 and five overall. So a slightly better season percentage-wise, uh, actually more than slight for Cambridge. Yeah, Coach Harris, Jim was saying before the game that Cambridge is a, probably the most improved, best team over the last year in all of Massachusetts.